It's so much easier to get started as a watercolor beginner if we don't overwhelm ourselves with tools and colors. So the paint I'm using today have very basic colors, only ultramarine blue and brilliant red, which can surprisingly enough be all you need in order to paint these three easy watercolor clouds. Ultramarine blue naturally has a granulating effect, imparting beautiful green and texture to the clouds we are going to paint. When you mix ultramarine blue and red, you won't just simply get a smooth purple. You can also see the blue and red tones coming through the purple when more water is added. If you prefer to minimize color separation, just simply use light water when applying the color on paper, which allows for a better control over the effect. Firstly, mixing these two colors. I'm using these two colors with some water to create a muted purple. So when mixing, just add a little paint would be enough. I use a water brush with a little purple color to dampen the area in the shape of cloud on paper. Now we can add a little blue here and there on the dampened area. Keep in mind using saturated paint with light water on the brush when adding the depth. the second cloud, we wash the area same as before. Before it gets dry, use a napkin to lift some colors to create ambiguous and soft cloud. The lifted part is now dryish and the background remains moist from the color wash. Stroke by stroke, we can add a little color starting the brush strokes on the dry area and extending them over to the white area, forming some cloud-like shapes, blending well with the background. If we want the result to be more dreamy, we can repeat the first step, paint the base layer. Before it dries, add some red without blue to give it a soft pastel thin. 